Hi there. Today I'm going to teach you how to play Philip Phillips Home the easy way and the correct way. All right, so this song, the first half is finger picking and the second half is strumming, okay? So the finger picking is a little bit harder than the strumming, obviously. So we're going to go over that first and I also want to go over the chords of the song with you, okay? The layout of the song, there's an intro, a verse, a pre-chorus, and then a chorus. Okay, so it's really not too complicated of a song. All right, the intro, he basically goes through, and this is throughout the verse too, but the intro and the verse are kind of the same. But this is what it is. You're making a C, okay, a C major, and then you're shifting between the C major and you put your pinky on the D string third fret, okay? So you're just basically putting your pinky on, pulling your pinky off. This makes one chord right here with it off. When you put that pinky on, it makes another chord. All right, and then if we look at the right hand, the finger picking hand, what we're doing here is this. Okay, so I'm plucking with my thumb the bass string in that C, which is the third fret A string, okay? so. And then I'm using my thumb and my pointer finger to pluck both the B string with my pointer finger and the D string with my thumb, okay? So, all right, so, see that? All right, so. Okay, so we know this part. The next part of that is we use our thumb to pluck that third fret A string again. All right, then our pointer finger is going to pluck that G string, okay? And then our thumb is going to pluck that D string on the second fret. Remember, we're holding the C chord the whole time, okay? So I'll do it slow and then I'll speed it up. practicing this really slow, sit in front of a TV, watch your favorite TV show, and continue doing this, okay? Program it into your brain, um, and it'll just come naturally, okay? So now let's go back to that second chord, all right? That's that F. So to make that, it's a variation of C and F. So to make that, uh, to make that chord, all we're doing is we're putting our pinky on there, and we're plucking the same pattern with our right hand. So watch this. Okay, so that's the intro, and that goes into the verse, okay? The verse is this four times. All right, so that four times, and then the verse, this, it goes into the pre-chorus, which you then go to A minor, okay? So you're plucking, you're doing that same pattern, and then you go to A minor, so it sounds like this. So the, pr the pre-chorus starts off with A minor, and we're still doing that same pattern, okay? A minor, and then we go back to that weird C, F combination. It's a C with our pinky on that third uh, fret D string, okay? Then back to C. Then back to with our pinky on. Okay, so A minor. This is the pre-chorus. Then that C with our pinky on, so it's kind of that C combination with an F. All right, then back to C, pinky off, then back to that C combination F. All right, and then it goes in the part where he says, I know you're not alone. Okay, so that part, he does just a little kind of uh, string plucking, okay? Two strings at a time. So, um, actually one string at a time, but two notes at a time. So, what he does is, he, when he says, I know you're not alone. So, 
he basically plucks the bass, so that's that third fret A string, and then plucks with his pinky, I'm sorry, with his pointer finger, the G string open, so. And then back to that C, we're going to move our second, uh, we're going to move this finger, the ring finger that's on the third fret A string down to the second fret. So the second fret A string, and we're going to keep our pointer finger still on that C chord, okay? And we're going to pluck the B string, which it's our it's our pointer finger on the first fret B string. So it should sound like this. Then we then we uh, have the A string open, and now uh, third fret on the E string. Okay, so sorry that was a little bit complicated, but I'll break it down for you even more, all right? So I'll do it really slow. And then we go back into A minor. Okay, so let's do that one more time. Okay, this is the pre-chorus. So, When you have that A minor, I want you to put your pinky on that third fret D string, okay? And you're going to pluck with your thumb, third fret D string, and then with your pointer finger, you're plucking that uh, that uh, first fret B string again, okay? So. So let's do that again. I'll do it really slow and just listen to the notes. You can hear it and match them up with your own guitar, okay? Really slow. Okay? Then the strumming comes in, okay? So next, he basically goes through what we just went through, however it's strumming. All right, so we've got our C. Okay, that's the verse right there. The C and that C variation F, okay? So just pinky on, pinky off. Pinky on, pinky off, pinky on, pinky off. Okay, that four times. Then when we go to the pre-chorus again, the second time when he's strumming it out, all right, it's All right, and he goes, when he goes, I know you're not alone. See what I did there? I had a C, and I basically went from C, I moved my ring finger down to the second fret, so. Then A minor, then G, and back to A minor. Now with that A minor, what I did was I went. All right, so I was on the A minor, then I went to F, C, make this. All right, then G, G, place your oh, back on the C, okay? So the chords are really easy. Listen along with the music video or with the track and you can figure out what the chords are. There's also tabs online which tell you what the chords are if, if I was too fast for you. Let's talk about the strumming pattern though. This is what a ton of videos have wrong, a ton of uh, tabs have wrong. Okay, I listened to the song, I did it by ear. Um, this is how he does it, okay? So when the strumming comes in, what he's doing is, let's say, let's go back to the intro, the C and the C variation with an F, okay? So the... So all he's doing is going Okay, so I'll break 
it down really slow one more time. to see my upstrokes and my downstrokes. <clears throat> I want to keep this video short, so I know I'm running out of time right now, um, so I don't want to tell you exactly my exact upstrokes and downstrokes. I think you can see in the video. So the last part is the chorus, okay? The chorus really isn't that bad. All it is is that C variation F you start off with, and it's the part where they're going So it's Then C, then A minor, then G, back to that C variation F, back to that C, now one time fast. I messed myself up. Well, anyways, that's it. That's all I have for you. I want to keep this lesson under 15 minutes. I thought it'd only be about two minutes, but it looks like it's dragging on a little bit. But if you have any questions, please let me know. Send me a message on YouTube. Please subscribe to my channel. I have tons of other videos, and I'm going to be uploading minimum one video a day to show you guys how to play songs. Also, go to my website, check out guitarmadies.com, and look me up on Facebook and like my page. Thanks for watching, and see you on the next lesson.